Uh, guys, we'll start in a minute. I'm waiting for others to join. I hope you can see my screen and hear me properly. Yes, sir. <clears throat> Okay, guys, so let's start. Uh, meanwhile, uh, someone had this question. Uh, uh, Juhi created this machine and uh, she added two disks while creating a machine. Two disks were added, five GB each. And now when she tried to add another disk, it doesn't allow her to add, uh, it, it says minimum amount should be, okay, let me give a disk name. Minimum amount should be 32 GB. That, that's the error she was getting. Uh, Joey, by any chance, do you have the screenshot of that error? Uh, no, I don't have. Let me try. This is the same machine, right? Uh, yes. I, uh, and you are trying it for 5 GB. Yes. No, I don't have the screenshot and I don't think so. I'll be able to do that right now. No problem. That, that's okay. But now if you can see, we have added a disk of 4 GB and 5 GB. So now, now you should be able to add another disk. I'll share the article with you that what was the issue and what should have been done. But okay. utna zada important nahi hai. Itna detailed troubleshooting aap logo se koi nahi puchna. Let's still, I'll share it with you. You can uh, go through that. Okay. okay. So guys, let's start where we left. I'll just open my OneNote. And meanwhile, anyone has any questions? Anyone practice anything? Uh, yesterday, I sent some questions to you guys, uh, jo AZ 900 ke online questions. The. I shared a few of the questions. So anyone practice, anyone try to answer those questions? Yes, guys, anyone, anyone tried at least read the questions? Uh, uh, yes, I saw the questions, but I didn't understand Which one did you not understand? You didn't understand the question or you could not answer it? Which question did you yeah. see? I, I didn't answer because I haven't saw the uh, previous videos. So I need to do that first before, uh, you know, getting into the, this uh, question and answer thing. Okay, no worries. And people who have been attending, guys, please, uh, whatever questions are there, please watch them at least once, try them. And if you're not able to answer, then let me know. We can definitely work on that. Okay, let me uh, bring those questions to your screen. So one of those questions is this one. 
So who can answer this? Any one person who can answer these three questions? I mean, it, it is just one question. There are three segments or statements. Who can answer? I hope all of you can see the question, right? On your screen. Yes, guys, anyone? What does it say that for, uh, if the statement is correct or no, that, that's all you have to say. And as your resource can have multiple delete logs. Uh, no, only one. Did you try? The log option. Yes. Okay. So if I go to the portal, that's only one option, which has this log function. We'll see that. Uh, and as your resource inherit log, from its resource group. First thing, do you understand this question? So if a resource group has a lock, uske andar ki virtual machine bhi apne locked hogi kya? That is the question. So what do you think? No. Okay. Uh, an Azure resource can have multiple delete logs. Many people are saying no to that. We'll see. An Azure resource inherit logs from resource groups. Sana says yes. Jaffer by says no. Uh, take it. If an Azure resource has a read only log, can you add a delete log to that resource? Are you guys getting this question? No. No. But you're not getting answer the question. You don't know the answer, no. or the answer is no. Answer is, answer is no. Okay. No. <laughs> right. Uh, unfortunately, guys, uh, most of you are incorrect. So let's go to portal and see. And this is happening because you are not practicing. Uh, yes, uh, Johi, you were asking uh, that you need some assessments or some, sorry, uh, some sort of things to do what needs to be done. So these are the things you can do. You can create some machine and uh, go to that machine and check about logs. So let's go to this machine and see uh, if we can have multiple logs. If a read only log is there, then can we have uh, a delete log if we can assign a delete log so let's let's go to the machine and say where do i see lock option settings in settings right it, it displayed under settings we have locks Okay, so I'm adding a lock. The first question is, oh, the first question we check is, uh, an Azure resource can have multiple delete locks. Okay, so there are two locks, a read-only lock and delete lock. So this is lock one, and it is a delete lock. First, let me create a read-only lock. Read-only lock one. We can create multiple. Read only lock two. Now, this is going to answer your third question also that if an Azure resource has a read only lock, can you add a delete lock to that resource? Now, lock one. Lock. So we can have multiple read-only logs. We can have multiple delete logs. We can have both of them together. We can have read-only log and then uh, we can put delete log. Is it clear? The second question is, as your log, <clears throat> does it inherit uh, from the resource group? So if your resource group has a log, I'll delete these logs first. I'll go to resource group. Which resource group this machine is a part of? This machine, it, it, it is a part of which resource group? Juhi. 
and where do you see that in under essentials right overview essential and i have been telling you always this is the path to follow so you'll know where are you exactly on the page okay so we'll go to that resource group lock and i'll put a read only lock Okay, I have put a read only lock. This is on resource group. Now I am going to any of the resources which is there in that resource group. For example, uh, this virtual machine. Or yes, this virtual machine. I'll try to delete it. Let's see if it works. What do you think, guys? Is it inheriting or it is not? Uh, Jay, do you need this machine for practice? No. Okay. What is the error message? It is locked already. Please remove the lock. So what does it mean? That if there is a lock on resource group, it is inheriting on all resources. Yeah, this, this machine doesn't have any lock. This machine doesn't have any lock. But where is it coming from? Where is it inheriting from? From the resource group. Is it clear? You remember we deleted all of these? Or ye jo lock ka naam hai, ye kahan se hai? This is coming from? resource group we assigned a lock to the resource group here and and it's not only that machine anything every resource even this resource should have that lock got it guys yes This is answer. Let me bring the next question. So unless you go through these questions and try to search something, you won't learn. In three questions, me, you have so much. One hour practical mil jata tha. Pura you you could would have created one machine. One clock yahan par laga sakte the. Then one clock resource group pe laga kar dekho. You you will get practicals. Bahut saare. If agar scenarios ko thoda achhe se padoge, to wahi par. Okay, let me get another question. We, are, we won't spend this much of time. I just wanted to explain it to you. Okay, approach follow karna hai. Okay, now look at this question. This is very easy. But this type of question interview mein kabhi nahi wala, guys. Okay, this is limited to your exam. You need to manage Azure by using Azure Cloud Shell. Which Azure portal icon should you select? So which icon out of this will you select? Yes, guys, which icon? The first icon next to search bar, right hand side. This one, All right? Yes. Perfect, yes. One highlighted you answer also correct. Next question is related to networking. So not covering that and the last question for today. The company has 10 departments. The company plans to implement an Azure environment. You need to ensure uh, that each department can use a different payment option for Azure service it consumes. What should you create for each department? And this could be your interview question, not literally in this language, but yeah, definitely ho sakta hai. realistic scenario. Hai. It could be a subscription, see. 
Yes, correct. Yes. Subscription. Subscription. So guys, please practice. These are very simple questions. Exam mein, interview mein, isi tarah se kahi na kahi ye hone wale hai. Thik hai. So please uh, keep practicing. Now let's move to our topic which we left. Yeah, we were talking about, we were discussing compute. Under compute, we started discussing NSG. Though NSG is a part of networking. Understand that, please. So anyone has any questions over NSG? people who missed those videos uh, please watch those videos first and then we will uh, if you have any questions then you can uh, let me know mm. uh, good guys if you are creating any machines please make sure that you keep them in stopped status at least once done working delete them but if you think so make sure you stop them उसको रनिंग में रखोगे तो काफी इसमें बैलेंस जो है वेस्ट होगा बट टुडे इज 10th एंड वी स्टिल हैव 4000 सो इट क्लियरली शोस दैट नॉट ऑल ऑफ यू आर प्रैक्टिसिंग फ्यू ऑफ यू आर प्रैक्टिसिंग बट डू नॉट रिस्ट्रिक्ट योरसेल्फ बिकॉज़ ऑफ बैलेंस आई हैव अनदर सब्सक्रिप्शन आल्सो बट दिस क्लियरली शोस दैट नॉट ऑल ऑफ यू आर प्रैक्टिसिंग ओके सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद दिस नाउ फ्रॉम वेयर डू आई सी नेटवर्क एनएसजी एसोसिएटेड टू दिस मशीन Yes, anyone from where can I see which network security group is associated with this virtual machine? और एक दिन के ब्रेक में भूल गए फ्रॉम वेयर कैन वी सी द नेटवर्क सिक्योरिटी ग्रुप एसोसिएटेड टू दिस मशीन इन नेटवर्किंग राइट so this is the network security group attached to this virtual machine now what does it say ye sare rules hai isme default rules hai ye hamare banaye hue rules hai right and with this uh, we had a homework in last session that you need to create a virtual machine and you need to block only one ip and allow other ips for rdp so who completed that jafar bhai and juhi you guys have that machine did you do that i can see if your machines oh, are there yes bhai yes okay so let's see so this is the machine you created right yes bhai i hope all of you remember what was the homework meanwhile srishti did you try uh, signing up for azure were you able to access your resource group yeah yeah i, I did i did created a vm and then deleted it okay you should have kept it if there is any assignment or something you can keep it in stopped condition and just for practice okay. if you are creating you can uh, create mm -hmm. and delete it okay okay so 3389 you have allowed any that was, any that was the default that i selected for 1000 priority okay and uh, the uh, the one with 500 priority that is one that i added for rdp to deny the public ip address which i got from google which was 92.99 which is your public ip that i will change to my public ip and then we'll see first let's say okay. if we are able to take remote to your machine okay 
I hope all of you are following what is the uh, assignment was given and what uh, he has done. I hope you guys are getting it right. Yes. So I'll replace your IP address with mine, Jafar bhai, and I'm not changing anything else other than that. Okay. Okay. So uh, yes, it is running. First, let's see if I'm able to take RDP. Uh, Shristi, were you able to install that uh, software on your Mac and yeah. take RDP? You did that, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. So the RDP is working for Jaffer's Jaffer's machine. Okay. I'm not able to. Uh, that, that's okay. I'm not going to log in here. We don't have to check that. Yahan par agar login nahi ho pa raha, then it is your OS level issue. Networking yahan par sorted ho gaya. The moment this page is appearing, uh, your <clears throat> Network is connected. If you don't have login, nahi kar pa raha, username, password, ka issue hai, then that is OS level issue. You guys don't have to worry about it. Okay. So I am able to take RDP on this machine. Now let me go to this rule and let me change the IP address here. This rule says that all should be able to take RDP except this IP address. And this is being created, guys, in two minutes to take refresh. Anyone has any questions on NSG, please ask. We're about to uh, finish this topic. NSG, other than this application security group, I'll teach it to you later. Otherwise, you can read it here. Application security group, otherwise, I'm cover So, NSG, we are about to finish. In today's session, we'll finish NSG. So, anyone has any doubt? That should not happen. Okay, so I have added my IP. I am still able to take remote. We'll wait for some time and we'll see. Yes, guys. Meanwhile, anyone has any questions? Kisi ko koi doubt hai NSG pe? NSG topics related? Or anything under compute, we covered overview, we covered activity log, IAM. I hope you guys, uh, people who have joined recently, they they are uh, they did watch the video of IAM, so they will understand tags. Tags, guys, is very important. In fact, we have Tabrez. He was also saying that he has recently started working on his uh, project, and now he understand that tags kitna zada important hai. <clears throat> because billing, patching. There are plenty of issues. Jo aap sirf tagging or nahi hoga, to itna difficult hoga. This is uh, our training environment. We hardly see one server, two server. Aap logo ne kuch bana diya to paanch chhe servers. Usse zada kabi nahi dekhi. Is isme aap logo ne I think at a time dasse zada servers dekhi bhi nahi hoga. Right? Look at this. Hardly five, six, seven. Itne hi servers hai yahan par. But production environment me, uh, I shared one image jahan par. N number of subscription, 60, 70 subscriptions, hote, thousands of machines. If you have to check out any data, you have to check out any data, you have billing, you have to check out any reason. Se kuch bhi check karna hai. So it becomes very difficult if proper tagging is not done. If tagging is done, then you have to let's say that you have to tag the application name. This is the tag. Hai. App name. And you have to tag the square. So I, I know that yes, it's not a service and yes, I guess are a pay square game. Yes, service are a pay square game. So tomorrow, if I have to check that, how many servers do I have for pay square? I can simply go and run a report. Jumper ek uh, yoga key value pair of a key over app name and the droga pay square. So jitne bhi app name may pay square ke server of your list much more easily. Mil jayegi. Then uske baad agar main ek or a rakta hu OS version or win or surf OS, let's say. Here is Windows, hai, koi Linux, hai, koi kuch hai. then I can have another filter. <coughs> uh, under T-Soft for application pay square, how many Linux server do I have? How many Windows server do I have? Ye sab jo hai, aap tagging se achieve kar sakte ho. And there is a policy where you can do tagging. Ye kar sakte ho. Ye company name aa jata hai. Even those machines which you guys have created, <coughs> let's say this machine. 
this is created by it is under Jaffer's uh, yeah. This tag Jaffer has given, but this tag it is coming through enforcing through policy. So tagging is an important topic that in that they have policy ka bhi scope de rakha hai. Okay, so so you see everyone you see Juhi has created this machine she added one tag department but this tag it is already there so tag tagging is very important it is very simple but it is very important diagnose and uh, diagnose and solve problems i have already explained it to you you guys will have to go here and check read steps this is very helpful interview map yahase definitely those which are scenario uthakar bol sakte one of the mostly asked question ke tell me something about uh, one of the issues where you you were stuck or you did something extraordinary ya kuch kiya to wo issues aapko yahan se mil sakte hai vm performance issue kisi bhi tarah ka koi bhi issue aap utha lo and then you can say that and it's not only related to vm <clears throat> if you go to any resource and you will find these options so we were under networking aur uske baad hum logo ne or a monitoring will do later we said uh, networking okay networking may we covered energy energy is completed today anyone who did not understand energy please let me know now yes guys anyone who did not understand anything or still have uh, still has a koi bhi slight doubt kisi bhi tarah ka So it looks like it is not working for me now. Okay, my RDP is being blocked from this IP. But is it the correct rule? What do you think, guys? Is it the correct rule? And to check that, to check that quick option is, to check that quick option is, uh, one of you could try taking remote to this virtual machine. I'm sharing the IP, and all of you have in front of you, right? So. Let me share it to you. This is the IP. Try taking remote, one of you, please. And Guys, can you hear me? Yes. Yes. Sorry, I think power cut is there, so my uh, Wi-Fi got disconnected. Got connected from the backup. Hey, so can anyone try to take remote of that machine? Can you see my screen? Yes, by I the try way? it. Yes. No. Okay, I'll share my screen. Uh, my extra monitor has been disconnected. Oh uh, yeah, sorry. Who tried taking RDP? I tried and it's asking for credentials. So it is working for you, right? Yes. Yeah, Even same for me. me. All right. So it is working for all of you and it is not mm. working for me. The particular, uh, this one which we blocked, it is not working. So what do you think now? Was, was it correct, the, the energy rules which Jafar Bhai created? It, it worked fine, right? What was our aim? To block one public IP. And now it's suddenly working, guys. Why do you think it's working? See, it You're is working. We're connected to other network. I mean, the power went up, so Wi-Fi is being changed to some other network. Your public IP is changed. Perfect. The IP guys, which you gave. Did you get it? What happened here quickly? Because I told you uh, power cutoff is there. So I got disconnected from my Wi-Fi. The moment I got disconnected from my Wi-Fi and I got connected to another Wi-Fi, my public IP got changed. Now, if you want to see my public IP, let me show it to you once. Earlier it was 100 wala range, mein tha. whatever it is, we can see that. But now it is changed. 
you see 152 and the one which we have blocked is 103 are you getting it guys did you get it what happened here yes Yes. Okay. Right. So now let's see. Uh, Johi, you also created one, right? Uh, yes. The one that you gave with homework, it's a different virtual machine that I created. And Peace that virtual machine's admin name is? Vala. Okay. Psoft Admin. I hope all of you are getting it that what are we trying and what are, what are we trying to do here? So RDP 3389, you say 300, you are allowing to everyone and then you are restricting RDP. So this must be your IP, right? Yes. Okay. And change that IP and we'll see. But first I'll have to check if your RDP, if RDP is working. Okay, fail to stop. Why, why do you think I'm not able to uh, start this machine? Do you think Juhi will be able to start this machine because it's her resource group? Yes guys, anyone? Even I can't do it. Why not? Uh, you must have read the error message. Anyone uh, anyone else who, who hasn't read the error message yet? Oh, because we added the lock initially at the starting of the cl class. Right. We, That's because why. we have put a read only lock here. Read only lock means that the resource in which status will be the same. You can't do anything about it unless you come mm -hmm. and you delete this lock. Is it clear to everyone? Yes. Okay, so I'll have to go here to the resource group. Delete that lock. Now it's deleted. And now I should be able to turn on that virtual machine. See, if you keep practicing yes, all the issues aapko bar bar aisa ja ke na, then aap logo ko ek alag se kuch nahi padna padega. Wo aise yaad hota hoga or then you will understand it. Uh, please remove the locker. We already removed it, right? Uh, so, well, I'm just stepping out for five minutes. Bar is start okay. Mujhe kapde nikalne. Yes, guys, I hope all of you are getting it. Okay. What are we trying to do here? What was the homework? What Jafar Bhai did? did uh, what Juhi did? What are we trying to check here? Anyone who is not getting it? Anyone of you? Okay, what are we doing? That no, should not actually happen. Actually, I had... Uh, yeah, I had this confusion uh, when I was created, when I created the VM and I, I tried doing this, but I got confused between adding the rules, but now it's clear. Okay, anyone else? Because that should not happen, guys. The moment it happens, what are we doing? What is our aim? Then we tend to lose interest. That should not happen. At least what are we trying to achieve? Steps ek do jate, that is fine. Wap log seek log next practical me. The moment you you know get away from this camp, kya karre, samaj mein nahi screen pe kya chal rahe, then se sara interest lose hona shuru jata hai. So I'm able to take remote to this virtual machine, which is fine because my IP address is not listed over there in block list. So we'll change that IP address. I'm not changing your rule, okay? I'm keeping the same rule which Jafar Bhai created. I kept it same and I'm keeping the same which Juhi created. I'm just replacing the IP address.
it's done i will try to refresh it for a minute now and then i'll try to take a remote it is still working we'll take some time and see meanwhile can someone else try to take remote to this machine and see if you guys are able to take remote anyone you don't have to log in just see if you get that pop up see i i have stopped getting that pop up which means my ip has been blocked now I, what i did I, I didn't make any changes in her rule just change the ip address replace the ip address with my ip address anyone else who can confirm if it is working for them Because this is about to finish at the moment this finishes we'll take a break of five minutes and we'll start we'll resume it uh 1645. meanwhile someone please try to take remote to this machine and see if it is working uh, i tried and it's working for me it's working great yep. okay guys we'll be back in five minutes 1645 sharp same link 